So I spent two years learning simplified Chinese. So going to China obviously makes sense. So I came home and I said to my dad, uh, so I want to go to China. And he's like, you mean Taiwan? And I was like, mm, no. Um, I think they use like different characters that are like traditional characters. He was like, so you'll learn them. And I'm like, dude, what the f <laughs> Like us on Facebook if you haven't. And don't forget to subscribe for more new videos. I'm Neve. I'm from Scotland. I chose to study Chinese and Spanish because I felt that they were useful for a business. After two years of studying simplified Chinese, uh, my university wanted me to go to China for a year and I couldn't because my illness stopped me from going. So after I graduated, I was determined to learn that god language because it's just so hard. So I said to my dad that I'm leaving you guys to go to China to learn Chinese. And without looking at me, he was like, you mean Taiwan? So I explained the difference between simplified and traditional and was like, so I have to go to China as I didn't know traditional characters. And his words were, you'll learn. Like it was as simple as learning to play hopscotch or something. I did try to wrangle Beijing, but he said, I'm paying, so you're going. And I was like, I hate you. Just for the record, I do love my dad. And I later came to realize that he actually has a Taiwanese friend here who can help me navigate Taiwan. And with a local person's assistance, my dad feels like I'll be a lot safer, granted that I've never lived abroad before. Now I've been here a few weeks, and despite the difficulty of crossing the road and the huge quantity of scooters, I think Taiwan is pretty safe and now I get why my dad wanted me to come. So far, I've tried a few different foods and I've loved the Shaolong Bao, Yu Rou Mian, mango shaved ice, and I tried a chicken food, which was a lot more effort than it was worth. Hey daddy, so I'm just ringing to let you know that I actually really like Taiwan. Uh, I love the food and I love the people. Um, and yeah, you were right. I told you so. The problem is now, Neve. I've got the blame for you going there, so I'll need to order my food from Chinese takeaways anonymously. Otherwise, it may be contaminated. <laughs>